Kyle Pepper's Professional Baseball League. I can't wait mm. to meet you. Right. Yeah, we're recording. Yeah. Oh, recording. Oh, sorry, it's Case Rio. good. Uh, hey there. Uh, hey, hello, everybody. Wait. Welcome to the Untitled Key Five Project. We're not okay. sponsored Listen by No, we're Taco not. Bell. No, we're not, but this Case Rio is delicious. Keith couldn't find where Taco Bell was, even though he's been there multiple times. I've been there before. He's pretty much, he pretty much lives there, let's be honest. Well, in all fairness, I've only been to that one once. True, <clears throat> true. But I, I figured your Taco Bell sense would go off. You know, it, it's like the, uh, it, it's a built-in GPS in the Keep Hot's head. <laughs> it's just, it's, it's just like Taco Bell. I do love Taco Bell that much. Um, but yeah, um, it was failing tonight. <laughs> But luckily yeah. we found it. <laughs> found. So anyways, what do we got here? I've actually never played this. Okay, so we're going to play a bunch of games throughout the few weeks uh, in the Jackbox Party Pack. And we're going to start with the OG. Oh, yeah. You don't know Jack. Nope, no Jack. 2015 edition. I mean, I've heard of this game, but I've never played it. Now, sweet warrior two. After you give us like, your musical styling. Uh-huh. And that's okay. Does that answer your question? Hi, I'm Carol Cutter, and here at Sweet Relief That's music of my people, studio, guys. It's <laughs> the music of my people. <laughs> All right, but anyways, yeah, so just use our phone. That's really cool we just put on your phone. So yeah, we just, we just use our phone. It's real accessible. And, and we're going to totally play this. And it's a quiz show. And it's a ridiculous quiz show. <laughs> and we're going to have fun. Games. We'll do this. That's what we're going to do. So let's do this. Oh, by the way, Carrie L's here. Yeah, Carrie L's here. <laughs> don't have a lot of game controllers. He's like, oh, I forgot about her. Because you can play I only, I only brought her. I did not use the controller. But that's just the beginning. In the coming years, it's my hope that instead of using a regular controller, you'll be able to play our games using a regular TV. You don't know Jack. This is You Don't Know Jack 2015. I'm your host, Cookie Masterson. And hey, wipe that smile off your face. Cookies this great. is serious. It's okay, just game. kidding. There will be parts and stuff. <laughs> I'm glad you three decided to play our little game here. Although I <laughs> suppose your options were limited. Handle those screws carefully. If you think an opponent doesn't know the answer, hit your screw button no, no and you'll problem. force them to answer oh, immediately. Yeah. If they miss it, you win big. <laughs> and our wrong answer of the game is sponsored by... <laughs> the San Francisco Otter So basically there's a wrong answer in the game. It is supposed to be wrong, but it, if, if it's wrong, to find our it goes with wrong the clue, the you game, get the You'll be rewarded with big prizes and cash. <laughs> so why not get started? Time to crash it! Run! To get started, booty full! Let's analyze one of Kim Kardashian's body parts. About what percentage of Kim Kardashian's brain is just made up of water? 10%, 40%, 80%, or 100%? Players 1 and 3? Oh, I'm gonna enjoy this. Player 2? Kim Kardashian's brain, and everybody else's brain for that matter, is made up of about 80% water. But that other 20% is just so round and firm, Probably, yeah. I can't stop thinking about it. <laughs> You're gonna hear lots of laughs. <laughs> Probably. How about... His acting is oh, alright, alright, all right, all right. So, you know how they called Matthew McConaughey's resurgence as an actor his huh. McConaissance? Well... If Matthew McConaughey is currently experiencing a McConaissance, then what period of his life just ended? The McConna Dark Ages? The McConna Industrial Age? The McConna Middle Ages? Or the McConna oh, Enlightenment Age? <laughs> Player two? Oh, wait, no. Sucks to be you. <laughs> Players one and three? I just got out of the middle. Oh in yeah, I got out. 14th century, immediately following the Middle Ages. So the Maconnaissance would follow the Maconna Middle Ages. Yeah. Just ended, not just started. Okay. Which is yeah. funny because most Renaissance sculptures also need to put on a damn shirt. That's totally different. Here's what I like to call. Brought to you by the letter U Nebrow. It's the put the choices into order and buzz in and see if you are right. Question. 
And if you get this one right, I'll rustle up some extra moolah for you. Arrange these Sesame Street characters in order of fewest to most eyebrows. Bert, Ernie, the Count. Ernie, Bert, the Count. Bert, Ernie, the Count. The Count, Bert, Ernie, or Ernie, the Count, Bert. Oh, that's pretty much blank. Player three. <laughs> Players one and two. The count would be so disappointed. Allow me. Ernie has no eyebrows at all. Bert has one long single eyebrow. And the count has two. Two eyebrows. It has been. And yet, we need to watch Sesame Street for all. I appear so. And on its way, Duck Duck Swan. Say the cast of Duck Dynasty attends a performance of Swan Lake and thinks there are huh. real waterfowl on stage. In their confusion, which character would they most likely shoot? Siegfried, Benno, Von Rothbart, or um, Dutch? Yeah, probably. Player one. <laughs> Players two and three. Odette is a okay, princess who has been so. turned into a swan, so the Duck Dynasty yeah. crew would probably fill her full of lead. <laughs> Especially if they find out she once fooled around with a lady swan in college. Lady swan. <laughs> I call this one oh, a man in the backwards for. yellow hat, and it's a dis or dat. Player one. Your score stinks at the moment, so this one's all for you. <laughs> I'm going to read off seven things, and for each one, you tell me if it's an alleged antic by pop star Justin Bieber, or an antic by the classic children's book character Curious George. If it's Justin Bieber, press the square button. If it's Curious Wait, George, press, press yeah, the we, circle button. Now the rest of you listen up. Try to pick an answer uh, okay. before okay, player again? one. If yeah. player one gets it wrong, I'll split right that out. cash among everyone else who got it right. Start, Alrighty then, here it comes. Peed in a mop bucket. Broke his leg falling from a fire escape. Arrested for falsely reporting. At the house. Got high on ether. Got a bugle to an ostrich. Went to a Brazilian brothel. Ew, baby, baby, baby. Ew. I think we can all agree that it's time right for that little bastard to get the pride. Uh, I have to get out of the negative. <laughs> Did that. Finished round How'd one, be able to make and player three is at the front of the class. Let's see if they stay there. Keep in mind, all the prizes are doubled in round okay, two. Here. <laughs> We're just so quiet, so focused. Well, the answer of the game is still out there delicious. waiting for you. Well, no Pizza time like the present. <laughs> Solid build! Ah! Try this on for size. Dumber and dumber. <laughs> Too. So there's Dumb and Dumber, and then there was Dumb and Dumberer, and then Dumb and Dumber 2. Makes perfect sense. Now, going back a few decades, there was The Odd Couple and The Odd Couple 2. So, if another remake of The Odd Couple used the superlative adjective, um, it would be called The Blank Couple. Odd, Odder, Oddest. Player 3, who gets you? This girl is a new player 2. Five seconds to make a choice. Odd is the adjective, otter is the comparative adjective, and oddest is the superlative adjective. Yes! But of course, everyone who made the original Odd Couple movies is dead, which means it's the perfect time for Rob Schneider to swoop in and revitalize the franchise. Yay, I can do stuff! Screw so easily, Player 3. <laughs> oh, brutal! Real brutal. Question 7! Yeah, I'm gonna change your life! Screw that 3 Open wide for let it, go. let it go, let it go, let it go. 
At which temperature oh, would Olaf from the movie Frozen melt and die? 30 degrees Kelvin, 30 degrees Fahrenheit, 30 degrees Celsius, or 30 degrees Rankin? He's a snowman. <laughs> Players one and three? Hmm, you may not know how temperatures work. Celsius. <laughs> Player two? 30 degrees is below freezing in Fahrenheit and insanely below freezing in Kelvin and Rankin. But it's pretty it's balmy degrees. in Celsius, about the equivalent of 86 degrees Fahrenheit. Oh, yeah. Cool. I know science! And I know, I know blah, 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 he can magically be okay. saved. But I'm talking about what would happen. Let it go! Let it go! I was thinking the freezing temperature, not the, not the actual melting. Yeah. yeah. Because if it's a few degrees higher, it's Fahrenheit, it would have been it. It's yeah. very two degrees up. Yeah. Coming up next, kangaroo, <laughs> peanut, Albert Einstein, or Uranus? Kangaroo, <laughs> peanut, Albert Einstein, or Uranus? What? 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 First spotted in 1879, kangaroo, peanuts, Albert Einstein or Uranus? Um, monkey. You'll pick one. Player two, do something! Player two? Albert Einstein was first spotted in 1879, the year he was born. Probably by a midwife right. or something yeah. over a century after Uranus was, was discovered wrong, and like, even longer like after kangaroos and peanuts. <laughs> I've heard baby Einstein cry. <laughs> 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 some important equations on the uterine wall. Players oh, one and three. That kind of place found me rather than a ball. Oh god. May I introduce wine or lose? If the Washington Redskins rebranded themselves with a non-offensive <laughs> redskin <laughs> mascot, what could they be called? <laughs> the Washington Chardonnays, the Washington Malbecs, the Washington Pinot Blancs, or the Washington um, Rieslings? Take a on the ride. Time is short. <laughs> Player three? That was quality. <laughs> Players one and two? Yep. This is right. Oops. Uh, I mean, oh, this is white, which is wrong. Snowbacks, no, yeah. This. That's the one I did. Yeah. Well, the Chardonnay's Pinot Blancs are all white skinned oh, grapes, God. but the Malbec grape is red. <laughs> Although, to a connoisseur like myself, Malbec is very offensive. I guess I do say it's quite a bird. Just another day in the park. Wait, swing at him. <laughs> this one's known as What? I want to lick and roll all night. If Kiss singer Gene Simmons' tongue grew to the average length of an adult giraffe's, how deep into a woman's mouth can he That's stick it when he it. kissed her? About 5 inches deep, about 10 inches deep, about 20 inches deep, or about 30 inches deep? <laughs> Player one. Oh well, my. Player two. Hey, way to be wrong. <laughs> Player three. An adult giraffe's yeah, tongue job, is on average about 18 to 20 inches long. So that's about yeah, how deep into a woman's long. mouth a giraffe tongued Gene Simmons could stick it. Uh, and I if Gene Simmons' neck size. grew to the length of an adult giraffe's, he may not even yeah. need women anymore. I was going to like 10 inches longer than what he already is. Yeah. Brace yourself for the attack. When you see two clues that match, press the X button. 2000. Ah, you already know the rules. Off you go. Your house is made of what? So if they match what materials yeah. are their houses made from?
Adobe! Adobe! So close. That's so fast. Dang it. Thank you, God. I don't know. I didn't get a, I didn't get a lot of negos. That was pretty negative. I didn't get a lot of negos. So I'm not telling me. Sweet. <laughs> Uh, player two, great game. I win! Because of Sai. It's just I, a trick game. game. You, <laughs> yeah. you don't know shit! Yay! Oh, that was fun. That's, that's really fun. Uh, yeah. I can yeah. see how much you probably killed a lot of time with this. Yeah, that, that, that is, you don't know Jack. You, some you don't know Jack. That is just one of the Jackbox games. Oh, uh, we'll be playing what's many, next? many, many more. Oh, what's so. next? What's next, Trevor? What's next? It's a bookcase. It's an antique. No problem. Hey, are you Let's okay? Let's go back to the pack. What do you think here? Should we, uh, because we'll make multiple episodes, we're just going to play the whole pack. Let's do two this episode. Okay. Let's okay. do two. Do two. Let's okay. go. With some fibbage. All right, fibbage it is. That, that makes sense. That way we can do kind of cut, cut it off. Yeah, I like that. That's a good idea. All right. Okay. <laughs> no, I have also no idea how to play this one either. I don't know how to play this one. I haven't played it yet. So. Yeah, the only one I've played is you don't know Jack. So. I wonder if this was a good, good of line or something like that. <laughs> I can see just getting a whole big part of this too. Oh, Let's yeah. get crazy. All right, everybody is in. We're gonna play some fibbage. Fibbage. XL. Extra large. I like my trick now. Kind of getting kind of medium. Hi, I'm your host, Cookie, and this game will be broadcast in 112 languages. You'll just be seeing the English version, though. Three players, like a triangle of total BS. Let's do this. This is round one, and that means you get 500 points for everyone you fool with your made-up answer. And you'll get a thousand for finding the truth. All right, pick a category. Oh no, guys, my phone's messing up. <laughs> okay, here's your first oh, question. No. The unusual Chicken Sophie Major Memorial Scholarships are awarded to high school down. students who have good blank. Now, use your device. Page. Yeah, go ahead. Technical difficulties. Technical difficulties, my phone's being a. I don't know what. <laughs> being a phone. <laughs> why we can't have nice things. No. Okay, I'm in now. <laughs> I'm in now. In this time. Yeah, you did. Right. <laughs> oh. okay. Let's try this again. Yeah, let's try it again. <laughs> Hi, I'm Cookie, and I sincerely want to get this insincerity started. Three of you, just like the three musketeers, but with slightly fewer pantaloons. On, Let's do this. <laughs> no, you're not. This is round one. You'll get 500 points for everyone you fool, and you'll get a thousand for finding the truth. Time to pick a category. It's not hard. You know what? We'll just stick with this one. Okay, here's your first question. A Florida woman returned home one day in 2012 to discover that strangely her blank had been stolen while neighbors just watched it happen. Enter your lies now. Uh. <laughs> 
Now time. Hurry, hit the live for me button if you can't think of something. <laughs> okay, here you go. Find the truth. Okay, what did everyone pick? Ah, oh, that's a good one. <laughs> well, don't you feel wow. foolish? Wow! How do you manage to steal a driveway? I don't know. <laughs> it was a brick driveway. How that happen? And it was stolen. Like a whole construction crew ever just watching you. I'll take your driveway. <laughs> And nobody Holy fell crap. for this one. Yeah, I mean, we can steal uh, Yeah, but then outside of her house? Yeah, she has well, my car. Plus, you gotta think Select that the uh, category. neighbors are watching. Oh, so. true. <laughs> okay, here's the question. Coca-Cola once commissioned a video game from Atari called Pepsi Blank. Type in your lies now. <laughs> okay, which one's the truth? Okay, let's take a look. <laughs> and that means some of these didn't get picked. This is a good game. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Up and top, baby. Yes, this rig show up in here. Oh, it's my turn. Um, category. I don't want picking. <laughs> okay, here's the question. The New York Times was forced to issue a correction after they incorrectly identified the Nintendo characters Mario and Luigi as blank instead of plumbers. Enter your lies now. Okay, here are your choices. Alright, let's see what everybody picked. <laughs> We're all for all for everybody's lives. <laughs> More money, more money, more money. What do we have left? One single lonely pitiful lie. And overall. Overall enthusiasm, overall enthusiasm. <laughs> this is fun. This is round two, which means oh, all the yeah. values are doubled. Exciting. All right, pick a category. Here's the question. In 2013, a zoo in China attempted to pass off a blank as an African lion. Type in your lies now. Shake that ass with me. Shake that ass with me. All right, where's the truth? <laughs> All right, who picked a watch? That's yes. a good one. That was a good one, Trevor. <laughs>
lethal became suspicious when it passed on a dead gazelle in favor of a bull. Yeah, sausage. that makes no sense. And the rest Everyone of the board see a picture of this dog. Selected. Just like that. Oh man, right at the top. Where I should be. Got some work to do. Time to pick a category. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> okay, here's the question. Pantherophobia is the constant fear of your blank. Enter your lies now. Okay, here are your choices. Let's see what everybody selected. And nobody picked the other lies up there. So that's all tense, and I was thinking pentagram. Yeah. <laughs> I was thinking religion. That was, that was good, that's what I was saying. It's like, I was like, nah, it's mother in law. No, that was so good time after the foot slashes. Select a category. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, here's the question It's time for a celebrity tweet. 4 32 p.m., the 22nd of May, 2012. At Lindsay Lohan tweeted, Blank is the best medicine. Type in your lies now. Okay, which one's the truth? <laughs> oh my god, it's so hard. <laughs> okay, let's take a look. Ah, oh, I knew I should have known. Oh, I should have known. <laughs> yes, I got you. <laughs> yes. <laughs> we all fell for it. I wonder if I work it. I wonder if I that bitch would well, say work it. <laughs> I know she did. That's why I put it. <laughs> all those are actually things we answer. Yeah. Yeah. What's <laughs> <laughs> Final Fibbage. This is your final question, and it's worth triple. It's anybody's game. Okay, here is your final Fibbage question. What Dr. Edgar Parker legally changed his name to in order to help his dental practice? Enter your lies now. For me, button if you can't think of something. My phone's messing up. No My phone's messing up, god damn it! You serious? Okay, here you go. Find the truth. Oh, now it works. Alright, let's see what everybody picked. Oh, that was a good one. And look what we have here. He drove Dr. Hertz like a bitch right out of business. And that means this lie didn't get picked. Hey, it's Hey, yeah, Trevor got it. Yeah. Uh, we got the phone. Oh, oh, my phone. Why are you not? Ah. My phone forgot how to phone. Look, you saw me pressing. It just wasn't working. Oh, 
though you got because you got white like everybody can pick answers they liked. So you, like after the after you answer the question, uh -huh. so I guess the person with the most thumbs up gets that uh, for their answers. Ah, uh, I see. So. Nobody liked math apparently. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you want to play that one more time? Uh. You want to move on? How much are we out of here? Uh. How about the next episode? <laughs> All right. All right. All right, guys. <laughs> this is five games, yeah. All right, yeah. guys. Um, well, I guess we'll see you next episode and play some more Fib, but just then we the rest of the games. All right. <laughs> oh, don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to subscribe!